I used to work for a carpet cleaning company that was your traditional bait and switch. We'd walk in, we'd advertise a real low price and like, you know, your little coupon saver type deal. And we'd walk in and we'd clean, it'd be a whole room, we'd clean that room. But for eight ninety nine, which is what we would charge, what would we do is demonstrate first what we clean. And we'd clean about an area this big as this table with our top package. And we'd get this area completely clean. Then I'd clean the rest of your room doing what I normally would do. So you'd have this giant white patch in the middle of your living room. And it's going to look like that. Guests are going to see that, and I wouldn't care. So I would pressure you and continue pressuring you until you got me to at least clean this whole room. If I clean this room and two other rooms, it would cost you almost $400, and I wouldn't have even cleaned your whole house, all of the carpet in your house. So that's what I used to do, and that's how I used to get paid. So do you think it, uh, there's a difference in hiring a professional that might use uh, other systems or other pricing methods? Well, I mean, if even the, the saying you pay for what you get is true. So, I mean, if you're going to, if somebody's going to advertise that this is going to be a higher cost and a higher quality, I mean, go ahead and pay for that. Your carpet is important as part of the investment of your home. Why not go ahead, pay the money, instead of having to deal with somebody like I used to be, you got to come into your house, now you got to haggle with them and all the deal. Just pay for the quality, get it done, get them out of your home. Makes sense.